Hey you guys, what's up? It's Lauren. I am live. I just finished a quick 22 minute workout and just whipped up something for lunch. I actually have a meeting to go to in just a minute. So I am just at home. I'm going to just quick shower and change um, and get ready to run out the door again. So I wanted to do a live video because this is so quick. It's such an easy way to get in your protein and your veggies. Um, if you just can shoot home for lunch or you can make this beforehand and heat it up in the microwave. Um, so I want to give you guys an idea of what this is. So it's what I'm calling my platinum protein bowl. And it is not very pretty to look at. I will show you guys. This is what it looks like. So you might think to yourself like, oh, that's kind of weird. What in the world is in there? And I will show you guys. So what I do, and I'm going to take a bite because I'm actually really rushing. Oh my God. This is amazing. So I've been trying to get a lot more protein in lately because I've been working out a lot. And I'm trying not to eat as many carbs. So what I did is I steamed this broccoli, you can see, which is regular steamed broccoli last night. I had about two cups left over. So this is two cups of steamed broccoli in here. I'll show you guys again as people are joining. Hey, Rach. Hey, Lizzie. So anyway, here it is again. Two cups of steamed broccoli. I also made homemade turkey meatballs. And what I do is I just get a pound of lean ground turkey and mix a third cup of breadcrumbs. I try to get gluten-free just for my own personal preference um, in there and then salt, pepper, garlic, salt and that's pretty much it. I roll them up and put it in my handy dandy little, um, uh, what is that, toaster oven and I cook it in there for about 40 minutes and they're perfect and I get probably about, I want to say like 16 turkey meatballs and I kind of use them in different recipes throughout the week. So I added in here four, yeah, four turkey meatballs, two cups of steamed broccoli. And what I did is I, and this is a really good thing to add. So this is my container from a program that I follow called 21 Day Fix um, through Beachbody. You can get all these size containers. They're really come in handy. They're color coded for um, the different types of nutrients that you're putting in your body. So for instance, red is protein, yellow is carbs. Purple is fruit, green is vegetables. So what I did, sorry, I just went ahead and filled up um, my broccoli in here and just scooped it and thought, okay, that's two cups. And then I wanted to make a really yummy sauce without adding a lot of sugar. Like I love tomato sauce, but there's a lot of sugar in there. Any kind of canned sauces also have usually a lot of sugar, um, a lot of preservatives, that kind of stuff. So I wanted to add protein in my sauce today to kind of make a bowl. And if you guys are not doing this, I would highly recommend making savory sauces with Greek yogurt. It is the best way to make a savory sauce and not kind of break your nutrient bank. So what I did is I just filled up. Now this is the carb box from uh, 21 Day Fix and 21 Day Fix Extreme. I know that it's a third of a cup. So I use it as a measuring cup sometimes. So I took um, this 0% Greek yogurt. I really like this one from HEB. It's really creamy and it's really cost effective if you have an HEB near you. I filled it up and then for flavor, my very favorite, Frank's Red Hot Sauce. If you guys don't know this, um, it's got some sodium in it, but it pretty much has nothing else in it. So I use this a lot um, for flavoring. It's like a cayenne pepper flavoring, if you guys haven't heard this. Um, but it's no fat, no carbs, no protein, really nothing. It's just going to add a lot of flavor. So I put about two tablespoons or two teaspoons in here. I think I shook it like four times. It kind of spritz out um, over the Greek yogurt in my one-third cup, and I just mixed that up. And then what I did is I put the meatballs at the bottom, heated them up for a little bit with half of the sauce over it and kind of mixed those together, chopped up the meatballs. Then I added the broccoli on top after I heated it up and added the rest, and then I kind of mixed it all together, and voila, you have a very odd looking, it kind of looks like, whoop, it kind of looks like broccoli salad, but it is so good. It almost tastes like a spicy, creamy, like Alfredo sauce. Anyway, somebody was calling me. Anyway, you guys, it's delicious. Give it a shot, like I said. Two cups, steamed broccoli, four turkey meatballs. I'll put the recipe below after this uh, broadcast is over. Um, one third cup, 0% Greek yogurt, couple shots of Frank's Red Hot Sauce in your Greek yogurt, mix it up. You got a really, really tasty bowl. Um, for those of you that want to know, this is about 303 calories. You're getting a ton of um, 
Protein, it's about 35 grams of protein with this. You're getting a lot of vitamin C from the broccoli. Um, lots of different, we're getting protein again from the Greek yogurt. That's why I like to use it as a base. It's more protein. Um, and this has zero fat. This has zero fat. The turkey's super lean. I think it has four or five grams of fat. Um, and the broccoli's super lean too. So it's a low fat, low carb um, option when you want something really hearty that's going to fill you up. For me, I like making stuff ahead of time because like I said, if you guys weren't on at the beginning of this, I got to go. I got a meeting to get to. I got to kind of just scarf this down. Um, and I love how I don't have to just eat turkey meatballs with a side of broccoli. I can kind of mix it up and give it a lot more flavor. So thank you guys for watching so much. You can always follow me on my fit channel. It is Lauren Wild Wellness. Um, it's on Facebook. You can follow me on Instagram at fit.wild, W-I-L-D-E dot and free, fit wild and free on Insta. You can follow me at Pinterest at the same exact things, at the same exact handle, fit.wild dot and free. Um, I like to post a lot of recipes and and um, cook ahead, things like that. If you guys um, are interested, comment below and let me know if you want to see this. I'm actually cooking this really healthy pork carni carnitas for tonight. Let me see if I can turn it around. Started this this morning. Doo, doo, doo. And it's just basically lots of yummy spices, um, pork with like a salsa, ver salsa verde sauce that is super duper duper um, easy. And you just pop that in there and tonight it'll be ready for my fam to take advantage of. So if you guys want to see kind of a tutorial or if you want to see a live video about that when I played it tonight, let me know. Um, other than that, um, you can always email me at Lauren Wild. I'm sorry, no, at teamwildrepublic at gmail.com. Um, you can also, what else can you do? You can PM me, private message me on Facebook if you're interested in getting a meal plan special for you or your family. Um, and I can make gluten-free meal plans. I can make vegetarian meal plans. Um, I'd love to do an assessment and put you on a fitness and nutrition program. I also love, 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 I've got my Shakeology corner over here. Um, Shakeology from Beachbody and all their performance blends. I just did a 22 minute crazy workout with Tony Horton called 22 minute hardcore. And I don't think I would have been able to finish at the end if I didn't have this um, recharge, this yellow, this bright yellow stuff. It helps you to stay super hydrated with tons of electrolytes and other really amazing things. During your workout, we've got a pre-workout, a post-workout. So if you guys are interested in anything fit and healthy, uh, follow me at all those different areas. And other than that, I am going to take this little platinum protein bowl and I am going to go upstairs and hit the road. I got to go. Thanks for watching, you guys. I'll see you later. Bye.